Love this podcast? Support it and sponsor today. Simply head to OzCastNetwork.com for details. Having toured some of the biggest festivals in the world and performing on The Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon, she's made a bold name for herself on the music scene, collaborating with artists like Lily Allen and Grimes and hitting number 39 on the US Hot 100. She's also continuing to make a name for herself down under, touring for Splendour in the Grass and Spin-Off, taking place down here in Adelaide on July 31st. She's an absolute star, and it's our pleasure to welcome Benny onto the show. Yeah. Good morning, how Stop are you? It. That was so kind. Just Good. made my day a little better. Uh-huh. <laughs> hey, Benny, I've got to say, the last couple of years have been massive for you. How does it feel to be in this position right now? Right now? I mean, yeah, sure. On our show. <laughs> Not on our show, <laughs> but I just mean with all the success you've had, it's been massive couple of years for you. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I mean, it's been it has been a crazy couple of years. I am just like kind of still a little in shock and it kind of still feels slightly surreal that I'm able to like just move to, this, to LA and I'm doing music and I'm just like, okay, I hope this lasts forever. When the world is all falling to pieces, it's strange that I have something that that I can do that I love, so. Yeah, absolutely. Bagels, designed in coordination with New Zealand mental health charity Youthline and neuroscientists to help reduce anxiety. How is the process different creating this song as opposed to working with other musicians? Ooh, well, I made the song with my producer, Josh, who I've done like a bunch of my older stuff with. It actually was different, even us working together, because I was in LA and he actually made the beat after talking to scientists and figuring out like what sounds and what like BPM and stuff have a way of like soothing us without even realizing it. I was like stressing. I was just like, how am I going to, how am I going to make a song that's like, gonna do this because lyrics can be so like not everyone it's all so like subjective it's easier to relate to a song with no lyrics sometimes but if you're trying to reach a broader range of people because it's like it's not so you know specific yeah it's choose Um, your own adventure yeah exactly and it can be just like even like background music but he basically just sends me over this track and I loved it I was like oh my gosh like Josh knows exactly what I like and he just sent me this beat that I loved got into the studio and recorded a bunch of vocals and stuff and I just wanted to keep it stripped back more more acting like an instrument my voice as opposed to like being like thing in your face the yeah. whole time. Yeah, definitely. Absolutely. I mean, we were uh, we were playing it before the interview actually to chill out a little bit, and uh, <laughs> there was a bit Richard's, of anxiety uh, <laughs> before we were talking to you. I mean, had all the technical oh, difficulties, no. you know, just reduced the stress levels. So we, uh, we he listened to it oh, a bit before. No. We were hoping you weren't going to join the chat and uh, hear us playing it. Be a bit awkward. <laughs> 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 you guys I've told okay? you everything. I've told you everything. It was very good. It was actually very stress reducing, and we're very calm. <laughs> Benny, you you. You're, um, you're known for eccentric, fun, and colourful performances. What can we expect from your set at Spin Off this year in Adelaide? All of that. Great. Mm. All three. <laughs> exactly what you said. Only a little bit crazier. Oh. Ooh, okay. I am just, you know, we work like, I don't know, I feel like when we hibernate or when we don't play shows, we, like, build up all of this energy. And I just have no other way to release it except for my Pilates reformer classes. So, you know, I'm currently in my hibernation period. And when I get to Adelaide, I'm going to be freaking amping. Hell yeah. (laughs) We love to hear it. Hey, Benny, your popularity here in Australia is only getting bigger and bigger, but you are a New Zealander. Are you ready for us to claim you as one of our own yet? (laughs) (laughs) Uh, I feel like I I would love to be claimed as part of Australia. Well, we've claimed you then. Hey, That's it. Should we do, is, this, is this the claiming here this right the now claiming. on the show that you're officially Australian <laughs> and a resident of Australia? I, I don't know what to say. Hey. I'm so... I'm so emotional. You can, we'll, we'll, have a, we'll have a party with you, Russell Crowe, Lord, yeah. and now Benny. I love Australia. Honestly, I love Australia. I freaking... I, have a passion for Australia. Well, when you hear it spin off, uh, do a, you can do a shout out on stage. Fresh 92.7 has made me an official <laughs> Australian, claimed as one of your own. I'll say exactly that. Yeah, like we'll, that. we'll be right at the front by the fence, moshing away, being like, <laughs> yes, that was us. <laughs> hey, you can catch Benny performing at spin off here in Adelaide <laughs> Friday the 21st of July at the Adelaide Showgrounds. You've been an absolute blast and we can't wait to see your show. Thanks so much. Thank you, guys. Oh, thanks, Benny. Bye.
See ya. Love this podcast? Support it and sponsor today. Simply head to oscastnetwork.com for details.